Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more Let's Play The Adventures of Lolo 2. Uh, we last left off, we left off with this puzzle, which is actually kind of annoying. You have to be very quick in this puzzle. And you have to watch out for Rockies, and they're very annoying in this game. More annoying than they were in the first game by far. So you have to be just very careful as you're navigating across this place. And just hope that they don't try to block you in anywhere. Let's see. Okay, I'll get this bottom one next. Haha, -ha, I got that. Okay, just two more. Uh, hurry, 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 hurry. Yes! Okay. I should be able to complete this. I've actually done this like a few times off screen. Because, well, they got annoying and blocked me in several places, basically. Okay, that works. Just one more, one more should do it. And there we go. Go away. Next. Okay, this one's kind of, well, maybe not fun, but it's interesting. You can actually grab all the hearts except the one above it. And then you can just do what you want with the other blocks. So, just move. Wait, I think that might be a trap. I probably don't want to do that. Oh, well, maybe. I don't know. Let's put it right here for right now. Well, no, I can't do that. Because I have to move down here somehow. Oh, well. Okay, let's try going down here, then. Well, let's see. Okay, that might actually work. We have an extra block, so I can actually just push that here, push that here, and then try to do something with this one. Damn it, I pushed it against the wall. I'm an idiot. Why did I push it against the wall? That was the stupidest thing I could have done. Okay. Let's try this again. Push that here. Push that here. Yeah, that's right. Although I could actually use this one. Oh, no, I couldn't. Because I have to push this here. Okay, that's right. Push that here, and then I can just go around again. See, I knew the solution to that. I just screwed up. That's all. And we're off to the third floor. Already progressing very well, but I progressed very well in the first game, too, so... I'm not going to celebrate just yet, but Lolo is, even though he has, like, nine more floors to go. Okay, Return of Dawn Medusas. I'm sure you guys remember those fun little enemies. I say fun in the most sarcastic way as possible. Um, just remember that Medusas can shoot you through trees, so be very careful when you're moving across here. I guess that's all I can do. We have an arrow power-up, if you didn't notice changes the direction of the arrow. Okay, I think there's a way we can actually block these guys, but I don't remember off the top of my head. We can only push these blocks, so... I don't... Okay, I think I know what, what block I wanted to get stuck in. So, let's just move this forward. Move this forward. And there we go. Whoa! I didn't forgot about that. Wow. <laughs> I need to be a little more careful when I'm doing these puzzles, I swear. Okay, let's see. I think I'm supposed to move on that side, actually. I have to be very quick about this, though. And when I say quick, I mean quick. I'll go ahead and change the arrow. And then when it moves, I can make my move. Okay, there we go. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Okay, that works. Next, I actually have to block it somehow. That won't be a problem with what I have planned, though. Because I can just do this. And that should be the solution. Yep, I'm good. Okay, another Don Medusa, of course. We always have to deal with these guys. Uh, we also have a hammer power-up which I'm guessing is to be used on that rock by the uh, snakey. 
I'm guessing, anyways. Jeez, I don't remember any of these puzzles. Jeez, I probably should have done some of this before I actually played, but... I thought I could handle it. Apparently not. Okay. I'll go ahead and block you. That might not be a good thing, but... I'm out of ideas already, so... <laughs> might as well give it a try. I'm gonna have to block that Medusa over there from the right side because I have to get the chest. Hmm. Well, maybe I can use that block for that. Seems like the logical thing to do. But what is logic in this day and age? Oh, I have to block it from the bottom, too. Okay, this might be actually a little more difficult than I thought. Although, this game's always difficult, so... Okay, yeah, that's. I think that's right. Then I use the hammer power up here. Yeah, okay, I think that's right. Oh, but I have nothing to shoot the snake with. Damn it, I already screwed it up. Okay, let's try this again. And there seems to be a siren outside. What it's sirening about, I have no idea. Well, I think I got this part right. So let's block you out of the get you out of here. Well maybe not. Well yeah, I'll have to, so never mind. Although maybe I'm blocking them too early. Sure enough, I'm getting stumped at the third floor, so. Let's see, this has to give me shots. Yeah it does, so. Although. No, that won't work. Hmm. I don't know. For once, I don't know. Well, I can't use any of the blocks anymore. Actually, I think I can. Let's see. What, what do you do? Okay, maybe I... Okay, I had to redo it anyways. That obviously wasn't right. And yeah, whenever you get a game over, like, it doesn't really matter. You can go right back to the level you were on. Okay, I probably am going to cut some of this stuff out. Some of the failure out, so... I think I got it. Uh, I had the right idea. First, you want to grab these three hearts. You don't want to grab that last one until the Medusa is blocked on all sides. I just realized that now. It took me a long time to realize that, but... Whatever, I figured it out now. That's what's important. So let's push this one up here. Yeah, this is really all you have to do. And now it's all just a matter of pushing the snake into the water. And you want to do it from this side, I think. Yep, that's, that's what you have to do. That's it. That's all you have to do. And I couldn't figure that out at all. So yeah, I get ready to grab the treasure, and there you go, level finished. Let's see, this one, we have a leaper. Oh no, not this one. I hate this level, I hate this level, I hate this level. I think I hate this level anyways. Because we only have two blocks. So what we have to do is we have to reuse the leaper several times. Now you're probably wondering, well, if a leaper falls asleep when it touches you, how can you actually use it in the first place? Well, first, I need to find a place to put these blocks. So, let me just... Get out of the way. I have to find a place to reuse you. Oh, shoot. I almost screwed that up. Oh, I pushed it in the wrong place. Wow, I'm an I'm a expert. I'm a genius for doing that. Ah, restart. I'm a genius for doing that too. Wow. Okay, this is uh, probably going to be the last level of the video. But okay, grab this. Actually, I might do this first. But what you want to do is you want to wait for the leaper to get like, oh well, no, not there. Well, I have to use the leaper left. No, I don't have to. What am I saying? 
shoot, shoot, shoot. Come on. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Good. We get the heart. Now move back here. And look, we get to use the leaper again. That's what you have to do. And not miss. You don't want to miss, obviously. Okay, game over again already. Okay, floor three. We got it. Okay. I got this now. It's not that hard. It's just... You want to be very quick with the Leaper, though, because it'll come back alive really quickly, so... Okay, there we go. That works. Now we can actually use the blocks. And all we have to do, put you to sleep right there. And there we go. However, I am out of time now, so I'm going to end the video at this ghastly looking level. Jeez, look at it. It's, it's insane already. Okay, see you guys next time.